Good evening, everybody. I needed a laugh tonight, I'll be honest, because uh, I'm, actually, I'm actually a bit sad. Sorry, bring mood right down. <laughs> be right Debbie down here, but my cat died, you know. And he was beautiful, he was, he was a Maine Coon. Anyone heard of them? They're like lions, they're like little lions, you know. He was the best cat I've ever had, but um, I'm very into recycling and repurposing. <laughs> and, and I'm quite good with the needle and thread, so. There we go, Fluffy, there we go. Okay, so yeah. <laughs> Thank you for that. It's nice, nice to see a few great, great hairs in the audience. It's, it's nice, isn't it? I mean, growing old isn't as bad as all that, is it? I mean, when I was younger, it's ironic. When I was in my 20s, I went to a huge amount of time, energy, the substances to get wobbly-legged, blurry-eyed and, and forgetful, you know? And all I had to do was wait. Because <laughs> it all happens naturally now, doesn't it? Yeah, so... Uh, yeah, I've had a few problems. I mean, a few years back, my mental health uh, took a nosedive and I was hospitalised for a while. I was in a psychiatric hospital. And um, when I came out, I'd tell people, be a bit kind, like, oh, poor you, you're depressed. Because I have a long history of, of that kind of thing, you know. And I say, no, no, psychotic. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that, 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 that was... That was uh... They stopped my HRT, you see. That's why that happened. <laughs> well, that's my story and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> <laughs> Because it's all about chemicals at the end of the day. It's all about chemicals. Um, you know, brain chemicals is what... what I mean, that's what I'm here tonight, really, to get my fix of a particular uh, chemical in the brain, which I think I may be short of. And um, I've, got, I've got a visual aid here. It's a bit like a TED Talk. Sorry about that. But um, here we go. Yeah. Uh, anyone recognise the breed? Doberman. Doberman. That's correct. And we all need more Doberman, don't we? Yes. Yeah, that's why we're here. Yeah. Uh, so Doberman and Dolphins, we all need those, yeah? More powerful, more powerful than heroin. The body's own chemicals that make you happy. Um, but if uh, you're struggling to find those things through eating chocolate, exercise, all, there's always these bad boys. Other brands are available and I do rely on tried most of them <laughs> but I wouldn't mind but it's not just the mental health it's the physical health starts to go as well I'm heavier than I'd like to be I really am because this is this is baby weight but I mean he's nearly 24 <laughs> and he still lives at home with us and we've got adult children living at home yeah Give yourselves a cheer. where would we be without them <laughs> in this brave new world of tech he helps me, he turned the autocorrect off on my phone. Because I kept texting my friend Trisha, and it kept saying trivia. <laughs> uh, but luckily, she's still my friend, and she lets me walk her dog. <laughs> no, that's not, not a euphemism. Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm a very boring heterosexual lady, I'm afraid. But um, yeah, so there's that. And uh, oh, where was I? God. Oh, God, the lights, the lights. <laughs> The memory, the memory, it's all gone. Um, yeah, so, uh, yeah, what was, it, what was I going to talk about? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I know, yeah. And I got a text saying, do you want to come to Pirates? I thought, Pirates? At the gym? That sounds like fun. So um, I turned up with my eye patch. <laughs> I still had the eye patch from my cataract surgery, you see. So I turned up already, and it turns out you made Pilates. Pilates. <laughs> Anyone been to Pilates? Yeah. You smug bastards. <laughs> it's a whole new world of pain for someone like me who's really unfit. But I think they should call it pirates because you do stand on one leg and you do go, ooh, <laughs> and you don't have to walk the plank. You're supposed to be the plank. I mean, fuck that. I'm not going to demonstrate. Okay, I could, but I'm not going to. Yeah, so there was that. I mean, the cataract surgery, yeah, yeah. But um, the other thing that I do is, um, I, I'm into my hobbies, you know, and knitting. Carl knows about this. We had a chat last time. Yeah, I, I thought I'd end with a demonstration. So don't, don't, don't panic, Carl. <laughs> don't panic, it's not sawn off. <laughs> knitting, very easy. There's just some steps to it, and I'll just take you through. I, I recommend it. It's very relaxing, meditative almost, you know, like mindfulness. 
Okay, so you st st stab it, you strangle it, you scoop out its guts, you push it over the edge, stab it, strangle it, scoop out its guts, push it over the edge. So that's what's going through Granny's mind. Okay. <laughs>